The Three Little Pigs Once upon a time, there lived three little pigs. The first was a lazy sleepyhead. The second only liked to play the violin. The youngest was the only one to work hard to help their mom. One day, the mama pig called the three little pigs together and said, Guys, now that you're all grown up, you're going to go out and build your own houses. The little pigs left the house as their mother instructed. Now they had to build their own houses. The first lazy pig wanted to build a house quickly and sleep. Oh, this is such a bother. How do I build a house? Uh -huh. Okay, let's build a house with straw. Then it'll be done quickly. The first pig picked up fallen grass and straw and built a straw house. <laughs> wow, this house is looking pretty good. It's been a while since I worked. I'm falling asleep. I'll sleep a little now. The first pig went inside the straw house and started to sleep. The second pig had to build a house too. Well, I have to hang the violin on the wall. So, should I build it with wood? <laughs> Let's hurry up and build it and play the violin. The second pig cut trees with a saw and started building a house. He built pillars out of wood and the roof with planks. It wasn't as fast as the first pig's, but the second pig's wood house was completed quickly. <laughs> the wood house is complete! My first brother built a house with straw, right? My house is much stronger than that. Now, let's have some fun! The second pig started dancing excitedly while playing the violin. Meanwhile, the youngest pig was thinking about what kind of house to build. Okay, let's build a house, a strong house that won't collapse. To do that, I should lay it with bricks, right? The youngest pig made an oven and started baking bricks. It took a long time to bake bricks. When the bricks were completed, the youngest pig solidified the ground and laid the bricks up one by one. Solid tiles were placed on the roof to prevent rain from leaking. And a fireplace and chimney were also built to keep warm in the winter. The youngest pig worked hard. A day passed, then two days, and then a month had passed. The youngest pig had not yet completed the brick house. The first and second pigs came to see the youngest pig. What? You're still building a house? Yeah. What's taking you so long to build a house? It's because I am carefully laying the bricks. But once it's built, it won't collapse because it's strong. The two brothers couldn't understand the youngest pig who was carefully building a house. Oh, jeez. It only took me a day to build a house. I built it in two days. Finally, the youngest pig's brick house was completed. The house was solid, spacious, and wonderful. It was cozy, too. Then one day, a wolf appeared in the woods. <laughs> I heard that there are little pigs building houses somewhere. Oh, I see a pig sleeping in a straw house over there. The wolf slowly approached the first pig's straw house. <laughs> slowly, slowly. He looks delicious. A plump pig. <laughs> The wolf decided to eat the first pig. Uh, open the door, little pig! I'm going to eat you! The first pig, who was fast asleep, was startled by the sound of a wolf outside the door. 
<laughs> I'm in trouble! Oh, the wolf is here! I'll lock the door! <laughs> <laughs> Do you think I can't eat you just because you locked the door? <sighs> the wolf huffed and puffed and blew the house down. So the straw house built by the first pig was blown away in the wind. <laughs> My house! The first pig ran to the wood house where the second pig lived. The wolf followed the first pig and went to the wood house. The second and first pigs locked the door tightly. The wolf said loudly in front of the second pig's wood house. Hurry and open the door! If you don't open it, I'll huff and puff and I'll blow this house down! The first pig said worriedly to the second pig. <laughs> Brother, <laughs> the wind he blows is incredibly strong! <laughs> the straw house I made was blown away! <laughs> My house is made of wood, so it will be stronger than your house. <laughs> You're confident. Okay, then. Watch what happens to this house. The wolf inflated his chest and whew, huffed and puffed. Thus, the wood house built by the second pig was quickly blown away by the wind. <laughs> you brats, where are you going to run now? <laughs> uh, brother, come on, let's go to the youngest! <laughs> yeah. The first and second pigs ran to the brick house where the youngest lived. The wolf followed them and went to the youngest pig's house. The first and second pigs arrived at the youngest pig's house and knocked on the door urgently. <laughs> oh, brothers! What's going on? The two brothers rushed into the youngest pig's house. <laughs> that punk huffed and, and puffed and blew my straw house down! <laughs> that punk huffed and puffed and blew my wood house down too! Brothers, don't worry. My house is made of solid bricks and won't be blown down. Open the door! If you don't, I'll huff and puff and blow this house down! You bad wolf! Go ahead and try to blow it down! This house is different from a straw or wood house! <laughs> You're pretty confident. Okay then, watch what happens again this time! The wolf took a deep breath in to blow down the youngest pig's brick house. <gasps> The wolf inflated his chest and who huffed and puffed. But the solid brick house didn't budge. The wolf was taken aback. Huh? What? Why isn't the house flying away? <laughs> Once again. As expected, the youngest pig's brick house didn't budge. The first and second pigs were overjoyed and jumped for joy. Hooray! The house didn't fly away! Hooray! Our brother's house is sturdy! <sighs> What's this? Why isn't the house flying away? The wolf wondered how he could eat the three little pigs. Ugh. It's built of solid bricks that won't budge with my blow. Hmm. How can I catch and eat those little rats? Aha! There's a chimney on the roof. The wolf saw the chimney on the roof and slapped his knee. I'm going to go in through the chimney. <laughs> the wolf climbed down <laughs> the chimney. <laughs> The youngest saw the wolf and quickly set fire to the fireplace under the chimney and boiled water in a large pot. The wolf went down the chimney and fell into the large pot. It's hot! It's hot! The wolf burned his bottom on the boiling water and jumped in shock. The 
the confused wolf cried for help and ran deep into the forest. The three little pigs giggled and laughed at the wolf. <laughs> <laughs> Brothers, my house is large and has a lot of rooms, so we can all live here together. The first and second pigs nodded at the youngest pig's words. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah! The three little pigs lived happily ever after in the brick house.